Forget about college essays and entrance exams. A new for-profit two-year college opens its doors in the loop this year, and there are only a few requirements to get in. Students must love movies, music, cartoons, or video games. Mayor Daly was on hand today for the school's official dedication. With a look inside Flashpoint Academy, once again, here's Christian Farr. Students want to be able to get a good quality education, but most importantly, be able to at least get a job. <laughs> Business mogul Howard Tolman says he is fed up with the traditional four-year college model. Most schools are still teaching in silos. Most schools are still saying, you learn just this. So we turned the fifth and sixth floors of the 100-year-old Burnham building into a for-profit college for the 21st century. He even decorated the walls with his own extensive collection of modern art. And he says a lot of students just aren't well served by the halls of academia. A lot of these parents don't know what to do with kids that are in the basement or kids who just haven't found a satisfactory college experience. Flashpoint teaches digital arts. Students can major in film, audio recording, animation, or video game development. The typical student is someone who's in a hurry, someone who really has a passion for the work. Film professor Peter Hawley says that students don't have time for things like lecture halls, term papers, and final exams. I'm finding lots of students who have, who have felt con, you know, confined by traditional academic environments. We're teaching them the modern way and we're teaching them how workflow and collaboration happen. This is definitely a hands-on college. You know, they throw you right in there. Flashpoint is more like a production company in training. Students put in 40-hour weeks and they work together on an all-school project. Today's students are creating a miniature animated movie. The director calls the shots while animators manipulate the action of each character using computer controls. And rolling. And cut. Good job. In the audio booth, a group of students provides the voices and special effects. Just keep your eyes peeled. Hey! At the end of the day, another group will have to edit and put together the final piece. All dressed up and nowhere to go. The whole point of the school is these four disciplines, which are so new and exploding, need to learn to work together. Tolman is regarded in the business community as a serial turnaround artist and has been at the head of 17 media, tech, and education companies. In 2002, he took the helm of the cash-strapped culinary school, Kendall College. The chefs all hated me because I've never had a glass of wine and I, I wouldn't know a, a good piece of food if you threw it in front of me. And I had 90 days and they told me, you know, sell it, save it or shut it down. When I got there they had a volleyball team and if you can imagine 400 pound chefs playing volleyball, you can imagine anything. And at both Kendall and Flashpoint, he's used leverage to purchase state-of-the-art equipment at a cut rate. We ask to get preferential pricing from everyone. We try to make them partners and to promote them as much. Now, in addition, they're all employers for our students. If we need to watch a movie, for example, we can just bring up a reference movie uh, comes up from the library. And so this is uh, Jean-Claude Van Damme, one of our most important uh, Amer you know, American artists. Flashpoint has yet to graduate a student or gain accreditation. Tuition is a hefty $25,000 a year, making the school a tough sell for parents. They said no, but I told them I'm doing it anyway, so. John Challenger is an employment analyst. He says that the film, computer, and animation industries are volatile, but there is still demand for these jobs in the U.S. But there are lots of small companies here that have demand for uh, people with these skills and a lot of, in fact, larger companies also that have uh, areas of their IT departments that focus uh, on people with uh, graphic arts and technology skills. Every corporation in America now has a website. Every corporation needs video, animation, needs these tools. Using animation, film, uh, technology uh, to convey your message is something that's really growing. It's a trillion dollar industry, digital entertainment, and it's going to keep growing. And again, Flashpoint is putting our students in the city of Chicago at the forefront. I want to thank Howard and all of you for your commitment to excellence in education. For Chicago Tonight, I'm Christian Farr. And we should mention that Flashpoint President Howard Tolman is also a member of WTTW's Board of Trustees. For more information on Flashpoint Academy, you can visit our website at WTTW.com and click on Chicago Tonight.